looks like I'm getting too much paint in my mop brush, so I'm going to have to really wipe it out. Okay. Okay, so you can work that to get something that is pleasing to you. And uh, don't forget that once you put in all these lights, then you may want to put in a few darks behind them. Let's work a little bit up here. Now, I have a dirty brush. I'm not putting more paint on. Um, I can pretty much just slough off the paint that's already on my brush because there's um, a lot of uh, extender. There's extender on my surface. Because I just basically want to widen this a little bit. without really calling attention to it. And I see on my photo that there's a little bit of blue there. So I'm going to dip in a little bit into the sapphire blue and mix that in. Right there. Then I'm going to take a... I'm going to take a brush like this. Get this real cheap any, in any craft store. And just kind of... really soften that out and I'm just barely touching that and I'm using a really light touch and my surface over here has dried down quite a bit so it will take take that without really messing it up. So that's kind of a neat look. I think I may need you know, tweak, tweak it as you will. And yours might look a whole lot better than mine do. So I'm definitely cloud challenged. Okay. Let's work a little over here. I'm going to go with what I've got on my brush. And I'm just going to try and get a little more movement in this area right around here. I'm just dabbing it in. Then I'm going to mop it to soften it. Then I'm going to whisk it. brush away from the windmill.
a lot of this is just kind of impressionistic right now okay um, if you want to or feel like you need to have some darks and go back to the dark gray teeny tiny bit of Prussian blue and raw umber and put in a few dark clouds back in through here So if you want to put some dark areas under some of your light areas, you can do that. Okay, to put some, some added depth in there. Okay, so play with this until you're satisfied. And I think we'll move on to the windmill now.